A new report from Talk News has revealed the Cybertruck is about to be recalled for a major hardware upgrade, plus it's going to get some software upgrades. Here's what those changes are going to be. Now, this sounds quite negative, but actually it's not because Tesla wants to improve the Cybertruck. It's nothing to do with any problems. It's simply to do with essentially a performance enhancement. Hello, my friends. Welcome to the channel. Great to see you. I'm Sam Evans. You're watching the Electric Viking Cybertruck. I mean, guys, I've just seen Cybertruck video from Tesla. You've probably seen it by now. Showing the Cybertruck do one of the most difficult off-road climbs in America. Made it look easy. And it was using, I mean, barely even all-terrain tires. I was looking at the tires thinking to myself, are they all-season tires? They might have even been all-season tires. They didn't really look like proper off-road tires to me. Anyway. The Cybertruck is the first vehicle to feature steer by wire variable gain steering, and it's a huge upgrade. Automakers, Legacy Auto, have been trying to work on this to actually reveal this product, this, uh, this feature in their cars now for about 20 years, but they have not yet done it. The system completely decouples the steering wheel from the tires and adjusts the vehicle steering ratio based on speed. So it's done completely electronically. And people say it's a huge advantage. I mean, pickup trucks turning ratio is, it's, it's usually pretty terrible, right? It might take you lots of turns in a tight area to make a turn. U-turns are very difficult. The Cybertruck's turning ratio is extremely good because of this. From lock to lock, the Cybertruck steering wheel turns only 170 degrees, meaning you don't need to do this. You can just do one turn. This means that to make a full turn, you only have to turn the steering wheel in less than half a circle. However, while this greatly improves Cybertruck maneuverability, Tesla believe um, in combination with the Cybertruck's rear wheel steering, the truck can possibly be, you know, nearly as nimble as something like a sports car. The talk news says that the Cybertruck's rear wheel steering gives the truck a similar turning radius to that of the much smaller Tesla Model S, but Tesla wants to take this another step. Tesla is ready to ship a rear wheel steering upgrade that should greatly enhance the truck's turning capabilities. The rear wheels of current Tesla Cybertrucks delivered to customers can turn three degrees. Even at this level, the Cybertruck already possesses an impressively tight turning radius. However, the update will make the turning radius even better. According to a Tesla service bulletin posted online, Tesla is working on a retrofit update to the rear wheel steering actuator. Instructing the company's service centers, Tesla has explained the condition of the retrofit saying this, for the Cybertruck, an updated rear steering actuator provides a tighter turning radius and people can actually get this. So you don't have to do this for your Cybertruck, but Tesla is offering this for free at no charge to existing Cybertruck owners. So the retrofit will increase the rear wheel's freedom of movement from three degrees to 10 degrees. Initially, Musk hinted that this change could be made through an over-the-air software update, but Tesla is saying, no, 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 it needs an actual hardware upgrade. For the service technicians performing the upgrade, Tesla has given the instructions to them, replace the rear steering actuator with the updated component to perform four-wheel alignment. At this point, Tesla said this, the previous rear steering actuator does not affect or impact vehicle safety or reliability. The updated part is simply for product enhancement. I've never heard of a manufacturer doing this, telling you to come in to the Tesla service center to get an upgrade. I mean, for nothing. I mean, you can just stick with the rear one, if the, the existing one if you want, or you can come in get an even better version. That's pretty cool. I've got to say it is. So what are your thoughts, guys, on this new upgrade for the Cybertruck? Now, we, we've seen recently a number of videos on YouTube of people saying the Cybertruck range is not, nowhere near good enough to know any what Tesla said. But then Edmunds have come out and said they tested it and they got 300 and it was more range than Tesla advertised. It was 334 miles from the version with all-terrain tires. And Tesla says that version is only meant to get 313 or something like that. So it seems like we're hearing all these mixed reports on the Cybertruck in terms of its range. But when it comes to steering and handling, people are saying the Cybertruck is unquestionably the best steering and handling pickup truck that they've ever tested, whether that's reviewers from actual car websites or that's reviewers from owners. So that's pretty cool. And it's cool to think Tesla went, you know what, it's already the best, but who cares? Let's make it even better. I like that. Thanks for watching.